Hi, my name's Kim Vodder, and I'm a junior at Purdue University in the College of Liberal Arts. I'm double majoring in photography and psychology. Originally moving into the residence halls, I never thought that it would be a place that I would call home for two years, but it easily began, became a place that after two years, I didn't even want to leave the residence halls. In my freshman year, my resident assistant was awesome. She had an open door policy. So for the first two weeks of school, we weren't able to close our door unless we were sleeping or unless we were changing. And it really, really helped because I got to know every single girl on the floor. And typically you would always hear girls say like, oh, let's go get dinner. So you always knew when people were going down to eat dinner. So it was nice. By the end of the two weeks, my freshman year, I knew almost everyone that lived within my residence hall. I really enjoy the football games because the student section, you are given a seat, but it's not really a seat because you don't sit at the games at all. Um, the student section stands the entire time. And one of my favorite things that me and my friends did um, is before the game, our first ever home game, on Friday we went to Walmart and bought really cheap keys and keychains because one of the Purdue traditions is that during kickoff, you stand and you jiggle your keys so that it makes a big echoing sound in the stadium. The best part by far about Purdue University football is after the game, um, sometimes even if we don't win, but always if we win, me and my friends will do a fountain run and we walk all the way down the hill from the Purdue University Ross Aid Stadium and run through one of the fountains on campus. Um, one of the really, really fun things about living in the residence halls is that instead of going out to eat with your parents every night or eating with your family every night at dinner, you get to eat with all your friends every night. Usually, a lot of times, I enjoy eating with my roommates. Um, and the residence hall dining facilities are phenomenal. They're really great because they're always serving a variety, and you can always check on the internet what they're serving that night before you go. So me and my roommates will always pick what our favorite meal is and then go to that corresponding um, residential hall dining court. But it's a lot of fun to with your friends every night when you live within the residence halls. Um, another really nice thing that I enjoy about the residence halls is they offer such a great community. They offer so many things to do. Um, while I lived in the residence halls, I was involved on the dance team and we competed in competitions. Um, I also played intramural sports. I was involved in both the soccer intramural and the volleyball intramural, which was a lot of fun because I had never played soccer before in my life, so I learned pretty fast. Um, they also put on a lot of really, really cool programs to go to within the residence halls. One of my favorite programs was bead night and it was put on within my own residence hall and me and my roommate along with some of our friends we all went downstairs and made beads for about an hour and a half and they had cookies and brownies and fruit to eat but it was really nice because it was at the very beginning of the school year so then we had all year to wear our jewelry and um, playing on the soccer team, the intramural soccer team for my residence hall was a complete blast, except for when it started to get really cold. Um, when we had our championship game, it was about 30 degrees outside and it was snowing and um, it had just rained for about a week straight. So none of us actually wanted to go and play, but we had to go because it was our championship game. <laughs> so we all bundled up in layers and layers and layers. Um, and as we walked out to the soccer field, we actually got really, really hot from walking there that we started taking off all of our layers and by the time we ended up um, at the intramural soccer field, we were down to just our shorts and our shirts um, that we had said that we would not play in because it was so cold. But it was a lot of fun. We ended up losing the game, but we had a complete blast. And now I consider myself to be a pro at soccer.